Hello everybody. I am so excited to share this vlog with you. We won. I have been waiting to share this with you. It's been a very long journey. We filmed the Great Food Truck Race All-Star Season in October and the results just came in and we are the crowned champs. What? We even got an all-star belt. Look at that bad boy belt. It is so shiny. It's been sitting, waiting to be exposed, waiting to be worn around this waist. And it's just so incredibly exciting. I mean, oof. It has been so much work, so much challenge. Since the beginning of this pan, it's been tough. Everything has been struggle. Like it's just been grueling to get through this. And now we're finally poking our head and we're seeing the light. We've worked so hard as an organization to be ready for this moment. And this win means everything to us. I was thinking back 10 years ago when we won. And I remember two really funny things. I had pretty bad PTSD after the win in uh, season two. I would wake up basically thinking it was the night before the last day of the competition and that I was late to production and we were behind on revenue. And so like basically waking up thinking I was about to lose. And it happened for like three or four nights after the show and it was like pretty stressful. And this time I'm remembering just kind of that same feeling like coming and watching that show with like my whole team last night I went I flew back from Colorado to celebrate the win with the Lime Truck Boys. Waffle Love was there. Some of the amazing production people were there. And I was watching and I was realizing I was sweating and I was like at the edge of my seat. And it's because, you, you know, you don't really get to watch an episode before it airs. So you don't really know how things are gonna be portrayed, what's gonna be seen. And on top of that, it's a pretty accurate depiction of what you were going through in the moment. I mean, there are cameras, you're struggling, it's a reality show. And so to think that you're really living that moment again and it's being filmed professionally by an amazing production team, it's intense. And so I got super sweaty, I got really anxious um, and it was just so fun to watch. And I think the most special moment of the whole episode was uh, seeing my mom up there. Uh, my mom passed pretty much two months, uh, yeah, even like right on the dot, two months after we got back from uh, the win. And so being able to see her um, light up with joy, I saw her in two different scenes. She had a moment where she got to talk on camera. Uh, that felt really, really special and really nice and um, was definitely one of the highlights of uh, this whole show. I mean, that was a big deal for me. And so now we get to talk about what's next. Uh, you know, last time we won the great food truck race, it opened every door for me to be able to create success. This time it's the all-star season. It's against all these other winners. Technically speaking, if you win, you're the champ of the champ of the food trucks. And since the lime truck did it, baby, again, I got this belt to show it. Yeah. Uh, you get to see the opportunity. I mean, it's, it's here. And so, what we do with it is so important. I've had an amazing media team be able to secure opportunities with OC Register, LA Weekly, OC Weekly, all of these amazing ways to highlight the show. And I've been really lucky. To be honest, as much as Food Network is a huge agency, they really didn't push the show. And I don't wanna say this in a negative way because you know it's a big organization and hopefully we get to work with them again. But it was kind of surprising that the ball was really in our court to be able to highlight this, this season. And it was considering it's an all-star season, that's a really big deal. So we took it in our own hands and we were able to secure all this great press. We were able to do a lot to create buzz around the show with the other teams. And so that was step one. How do we get the most exposure out of this win? And I feel like we've been doing a good job. And now it's all about honing it into the brands. The Lime Truck, born from the Lime Truck, the brick and mortar in Irvine has been up in revenue. Hopefully it'll keep going. The Lime Truck itself has been crushing. We do catering a lot with the Lime Truck. 
So holla if you ever need an event. That's been extremely busy. The amount of leads that we're getting in for catering has just quadrupled. And then you look at Snibs, and there was shout outs on the show last night with the shoe box. And that's another great story. So I figured with the all-star season, they would highlight uh, all the things that we're up to. Jesse's doing these amazing things. Mark is running our whole organization as far as food. And they really didn't show that because probably there was just too much things going on in the show to take time away and do backstory. But one of the main reasons I wanted to go was to support all my brands. Um, it was a big sacrifice that I had to leave each business behind. And so I wanted each business to win from it. And so seeing my snip shoebox in every scene, I placed it there because I knew it was the finale. I knew that they would have to show the truck. And so I figured, hey, if I put snip boxes everywhere, I'm definitely going to get to show them. And I was right. I saw it all over the season finale, which was so awesome. I saw my Hatch logo front and center for my Japanese restaurant. My catering brands are gonna be able to get a lot of exposure through my own personal brand. And so all the companies are gonna win from this. Obviously, Born From The Lime Truck is gonna get the most. And a huge announcement is we are releasing franchising for Born From The Lime Truck brick and mortar and food truck, which is a huge deal. It's not available in every state, but it is a exciting moment because I get to expand my brand through other entrepreneurs, which is like my dream. I love entrepreneurship. I love supporting other entrepreneurs to create a environment where we can all win together and like get to work with all these minds who are vested into the brand. I'm just extremely grateful. And I think this is going to be such a fun path forward. So I'm feeling it. I'm feeling the wins. I'm feeling super excited. I'm putting it into the world today that I want more opportunity to come out of this win. And I really am just feeling like something big is gonna come out of this. And so I hope to share with you that it's all great news and that all this hard work is starting to finally pay off. And I just wanna take a moment to just look back to when I started this first vlog, uh, roughly about two and a half, three months ago. I'm starting a vlog and there's a reason why. In 60 days, I think my whole life is going to change. I mean, I was in a really tough financial place with the business. I was in a really deeply difficult emotional place because uh, I had just left my girlfriend, which we are now back together and working it out. I had really felt alone without my mom. And I started that vlog at such a low point only to share that if you work hard on change and I'm able to work with you as my community and hold myself accountable, that things could get better. And I think last night I was having all these feels because I'm seeing and believing that through hard work and through change and through good ethics and morals and really focusing on what you want, you're able to create a lot of opportunity. And so I feel so blessed to be on the great food truck race. I feel even more blessed to have won. My competitors were fierce. At no moment did I think that I was going to pull away. Every second of it was nail biting because every team was so good. And so being able to succeed in that moment was so big and I'm excited to do it in life. And so I'm taking what I learned I'm taking that feeling and I'm going to multiply it through my everyday life. And so thank you for supporting me. Love you. I will see you next week with some more great updates. And we won! Yeah, lime truck, lime truck. Oh, it's so exciting. All right, bye.